Hi YouTube, this is Venus. Thanks so much for stopping by. Today I wanted to talk more about drawing something when you journal. Drawing is another wonderful therapeutic thing to do. When we color, when we create in any way, it is just good for our souls. Currently, I am enjoying coloring. I just wanted to share some of those things. Uh, today, I got to go to a Zentangle class. And in the Zentangle class, not only do we draw a, a Zentangle uh, frame or formation, but we also colored it. And we used coloring pencils, so watercolor pencils, like this. And then we took a um, paintbrush, dipped it in water, and we enhanced the color. We also used some markers as well. It was a lot of fun, and this is what I ended up with. So I'm gonna take this picture, and along the frame, I'm going to, um, I got a date there, but I'll probably write who the artist was, who my friend was that I went with, and how the weather was that day. So this is just a wonderful memory. I'll add that to my journals. The other thing I wanna talk about, share with you, is two books that are just helping me to draw more. One is this neat journal called by the National Audubon Society called the Birders Journal. And it's just a beautiful journal. And the way it's laid out, it um, tells you information about bird watching and how to look for birds. It gives you the anatomy of the bird, it talks about the state bird, and then your journal entries are field observations where you can say every part of the bird that you saw and then there's a spot to draw your bird. So I have not done that yet, but I will be doing that. So I'm excited about this book to do that with. And then the second book that I'm really enjoying, I read this book, I think within a day. It's a great read, but just a lot of good instruction. And this is called Drawn to Nature through the journals of Claire Walker Leslie. And she is an artist, a nature lover, a, a author, and this is a great book of just really simplifying your, um, your artwork. Just make it real simple, how she captures the sky, the ground, um, the clouds. Um, she's really big on us really just looking at nature and keeping it simple. So I just got started with this and I hope to have um, some pictures to share soon. And I did do a little something today, so I just looked in the back of my yard and I drew what I felt was a image of my pine trees. So someone might see this as carrots or even a picket fence, but this is representing the pine trees and the green is representing the needles. And I enjoy doing that. I can't explain to you how therapeutic it is to do that. So I just want to encourage you to keep on journaling. And the tip today is continue to try to draw. It is wonderful. Um, it's the best therapy for all of us. So thank you so much for stopping by. Be sure to share, subscribe, and make a comment. Thanks so much for stopping by. Hope to see you again soon. Bye.